when I was about seven years old, I auditioned for this show kids choir and I was really excited. I wanted, it was a traveling choir and I auditioned and I hoped, you know, that I would make the choir and I, I didn't. I got, they got the call. My mother got a letter or a call. I think it, I think it was a letter. Um, letting her know that I what I didn't make the show kids choir and I was so sad and because I was so sad when she saw in the newspaper that they were that Dollywood was hiring um, for their new year their, their next season she decided to call them up and and say hey are you needing any little girls you know in your shows this year and they said we're actually looking for one little girl to portray a young Dolly Parton and so my mom said well can my daughter come and audition and they said sure and I ended up getting the part and I was in that show where I portrayed Dolly Parton as a child for three years I was in that show and I went on to perform in other shows on the Parkway, Country Tonight Theater, and at the time the Smoky Mountain Jubilee, and uh, Governor's Palace when it was there, and, and stuff like that. And, and it was just, that is, honestly, that's what shaped me into anything, whatever I am today. That's a big part of, of um, how I learned so much about not only being on stage, but learning um, what worked for my voice, learning like just little things, hard work, taught me a lot of hard work. We did, um, at Country Tonight, we did sometimes seven days a week, two shows a day, two two hour shows a day uh, for 40 days straight plus Christmas show rehearsals. So um, to have that type of schedule when you're, you know, 11 and 12 years old and then 15 through 20, that's, you, you really learn a lot really quickly and, and it really just taught me so much. I, I'm so thankful for that time in my life and to be able to perform thousands of shows before I even moved to Nashville. That was, um, I'm so grateful for that.